So the Pacific Classic Stakes is next as we jet off to California for a group one on the dirt. And this one is over a mile and a quarter, mile and two furlongs. And at the top we've got Bill Cipher for Leon Van Rensburg, Cuban Manadan for David Robertson, Dr. DeRouve for Padre Hogan, Filibuster Hair Martin, the Missile Cat John Morgan, Thunder Thor for Craig Allen, Cottage Pie, David Robertson, Desperado, Leon Van Rensburg, Good American, David Hooley, Drayden Van Dyke, Paul Rhodes, is that your final answer? Joshua Sutherland, Special Tonic, Craig Beckwith, Appenzel, Darren Thompson has also got Kraskend Ocean, Elmbrath Githaniel for Craig Allen, and Elderberry Symphony and Hopeswell for Dan Hughes at the bottom, so a field of 17 for this one then. On the dirt, ready to go, and we've got a couple of, un oh, ready to go in their race, we've got a couple of unbeaten newcomers in this, two wins and for Cuban Man, although that one was around last season, having a late start to its season this year, and another John Morgan horse that won its opener, but it's Is That Your Final Answer, who's gone off into the lead, that one likes to do that, hasn't managed to stay there yet though, and it's Is That Your Final Answer that's in the lead by about five lengths to Missile Cat and Thunder Thor, filibuster here has got the rail, in fourth place, then comes Cottage Pie and Craskend Ocean. Hopeswell is next, looking towards the back. Dr. DeRouve is the early back marker. The two caught wide, one of the uh, Greg Allen horses, and at the grey as well. But that one's now cut into the inside. But it's Is That Your Final Answer is in the lead by about five lengths to Missile Cat and Filibuster Hare and Cottage Pie and Craskend Ocean. They're virtually all in a line. Appenzel is just behind them. Cuban Manadan wide on the track. Desperado is also up there as well. Also now being pushed along his special tonic and towards the back Dr. DeRuve is still the back marker Drayden Van Dyke is a little bit closer than normal today so don't rule that one out and it's is that your final answer who's four lengths clear of Thunder Thor in second Missile Cat in third Cottage Pie on the outside is in fourth Filibuster Hare now making a move on the rail after that one comes Bill Cipher Cottage Pie Hope Swell is still there as well but it's is that your final answer who leads from Filibuster Hare in second Craskend Ocean moving through in third now they're beginning to close the run the pack Missile Cat Cottage Pie hopes well good Americans coming through with a run but it still is that your final answer then now being collared by Missile Cat Missile Cat's cruising in second and it is that your final answer in the lead Missile Cat's in second gap back to Appenzell and filibuster here and then good American and special tonic Drayden Van Dyke now starting its run but is that your final answer is sticking on in the lead today is that your final answer then from Missile Cat special tonic here comes filibuster here with a good looking one on the outside it's Missile Cat in the lead filibuster here inside the final furlong it's Missile Cat in front filibuster here is Trying to throw down a challenge on the outside. Missile Cat's in front. Filibuster Hare's trying to get going. Finishing fast is Drayden Van Dyke. But Missile Cat's got a hold on and take it. Missile Cat takes it. Filibuster Hare is second. Drayden Van Dyke is third. Special Tonic fourth. Is that your final answer? Fifth. That one stuck on better today than normal. And it looked like it was going to stay in the lead for a while. One or two of those disappointing out the back. But Missile Cat, John Morgan seems to have found a good bunch of horses in the first part of the season while the rest of us were busy with the season he was busy beavering away getting some new horses ready to bring in a missile cat is another one he's just taken the nunthorpe earlier and now he's taking a middle distance race as well so missile cat unbeaten for john morgan filibuster here run a big race for martinino in second that's been an enigma of a horse it was second in their world cup on the first week of the season done nothing since obviously only goes on the dirt Traden van dyke for paul rhodes was third Back to form after a few disappointing runs. Special tonic for Craig Beckwith fourth. And is that your final answer for Joshua Sutherland? Was in the lead for a long way and ran a big race in fifth.